displaying your happiness to people, your joys, the things that you got up to. Hold on a minute. The next time you're out, you're enjoying yourself with your brother, your sister, your spouse, and then you feel that impulse to put your hand in your pocket and to snap what you're doing. Hold on a minute, just pause for a minute. Why am I feeling the need to show people what I'm doing? Why am I feeling that? What made me feel that? Why is it that I need people to validate my happiness? Why do I need people to reassure me that I'm having a good time? It's as if I can't have fun unless people tell me that you're having fun. Now keep the phone there in your pocket and realize that when you are constantly showing the world your joys, your successes, the barbecues, the vacations, what are you doing? You're bringing the eyes of people upon yourself. You are bringing their eyes upon you and your family and your money, your health. And then you wonder why you have anxieties, why you're depressed, why, you're, why you're, you're, your life is melting away before your very eyes. You brought this upon yourself, we did. And that is why the Nabi Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he said, in the hadith which Tabarani writes on the authority of Mu'adh ibn Ujjah, he said, "Istainu ala qadai hawaijikum bil kitman, fa inna kulla di ni'matin mahsul." He said, "Make sure that you hold on to privacy when you're fulfilling your endeavors, because everybody who has a blessing is envied." Did you get the hadith? Phenomenal words. Hold on to privacy, secrecy when you're fulfilling an endeavor. Don't go telling everyone about it. Why? Because every blessed man has an envier. So keep people away from you. Keep the eyes of people away from your family, away from your property, away from your life.